Back in Colorado, however, investigators are able to trace the manufacturer of the greeting card and trace it back to a store near the Helmick's home. With video surveillance, cops are able to prove Miriam purchased the card. There was a small life insurance policy that Miriam would receive upon Alan's death. What was interesting is she had tried to take out a much larger policy earlier in the year on Alan's life in the amount of $2 million. And when they told her that he would need to be included in that application process, that's when she declined to notify him. She did not want him to know that she was seeking this large life insurance policy. Police also allege she forged checks and withdrew money from Alan's accounts.